Hello guys, uh, I'm Ajahat Ahmed and today I'm going to show you how you can make a 3D object in Adobe Photoshop CS6. So I'm going to show you two methods for it. Uh, one is uh, manually and second is automatically. So first we will see how you can make a 3D object uh, manually. So first of all, uh, create uh, any image. I'll just select it. I'm going to select this image just hold on control and press uh, click on the layer and it will select the image and copy it and then paste it so i'm gonna make it just smaller right click lesser tool and click on free transform and make it smaller this it's okay and then apply then if you want to make uh, it 3d just copy uh, or duplicate the layer and here you go and then what you will do next is just drag down the layer from wherever you point you like it's okay uh, and here so now uh, right click on the first layer and click on blending tools and then uh, go to stroke and here you can see that it's stroke and click stroke and make the size to one okay click ok and then go to just second layer options stroke and make it one um, size one and okay now as you can see that there is a basic um, 3d model but there is no shadows or uh, something like this and uh, it is not really good so we just go to first layer right click on it click on blending options and then click on drop shadows and then uh, make the capacity to 88 percent and distance to a little bit 12 uh, spread it and make the size a little bit more so it will look like shadow smaller okay then click on okay and now click on first layer second layer which you have uh, duplicated uh, click on blending options and then click on drop shadow and here now you will have to uh, spread the shadow like this uh, make a distance more now change the angle from the point whichever you like I think it's uh, good now check the size distance make sure uh, to see where it is perfect and do it there Increase the distance, spread it, but don't spread it much because it is it will not look uh, real. And there it is. Still something. It's not good. Okay, first shadow is too much for us, so make it smaller. smaller distance and here you go now you can see that your 3d object is manually created now you can make uh, many other objects manually uh, now the second method I'm going to show you is automated so create a new layer I'll paste the object and make it smaller and there you go now click um, press control and select the layer and click on lesser tool and right click on it and click on new 3d execution it is saying that you are about to create a 3d layer which you would like to switch to 3d workspace yes and here you go now you can change its uh, perspectives change its 
camera. Uh, it's much better here. As you can see that uh, we have created a 3D layer. Just click on any other tool and you will see the 3D object. It is also the simpler but uh, I recommend to make it manually. Uh, it looks more uh, realistic but it is more good. Uh, as you can see that I, if I can move the object it look like 3D. It's more. I like it. Uh, or you can make it like this thank you guys for watching if you have any question please feel free to ask and don't forget to subscribe me